Okay, y'all, so today my mouth feels it's a lot of pressure, especially like on two front teeth and the bottom row. It's like so much pressure, but it don't, it's not like what you would call pain. Like when they say pain, I'm thinking I'm going to be crying and like, oh my God, I just need to take these out right now. Like that, like no, and if this is, it's not that bad. They kind of scratching up my mouth a little bit, but it ain't that bad. It's just like a little bit of sore. And I guess my mouth can handle it because... I'm always biting the inside of my mouth like when I'm um chewing gum or something like that. So it's not nothing too serious. But anyway, I went to crack a barrel. Um, I didn't take any medicine today because I don't need no medicine. She you don't it's not that painful. Um so I'm just hoping that tomorrow It's a better day. Anyway, that's all I think. That's all for this update. This is day two. Okay, y'all. So it is ten o'clock at night. This is day two again. Um, my mom still feel the same. It's still taking some getting used to. All I know. Is that because I took a nap? I took a nap at like I don't know what time I took a nap, but I think I took a nap at like two hours. I woke up at like nine something. When I woke up, I felt no pressure, no pain, no nothing. And I was like, dang, that shit healed fast. Like, well, not healed fast, but you know, then five minutes passed and the shit started, you know what I'm saying, tingling again. So I guess when I'm asleep, you know, everything go no, That what it seemed like. And I'm just. I cannot wait until the day where I don't feel any pressure, you know, but anyway, that is my update for day two, ain't nothing changed, what I ate today was, I ate some soup this morning, slash afternoon, some mashed potatoes and carrots from Crackberry again, this is so good. And the carrots are real soft, like they soft and they sweet. Like you can just mush them in your mouth with your tongue and get food for your mouth. And some yogurt, chicken alfredo with broccoli and got mushrooms in it. But I can only eat the noodles. Like I can't eat the chicken, I can't eat the broccoli because I have to chew it. But I haven't really been like eating like how I wanted to eat because I, I don't be having time to brush my teeth and floss. This is too much. So, you know. But I just got through eating the noodles from the Alfredo, some more carrots, and some mashed potatoes. Shit don't go together, but hey, whatever. Um, Yeah, that's it. Nothing new is going on. Um, I'm going to come back tomorrow and update you guys on day three. But day two has been a breeze. You know, I know, you know, excruciating pain or anything like that. Yeah, it's kind of tight. To where like i'm a little irritated sometimes but you know other than that everything's fine but i'll see y'all tomorrow bye y'all okay so last night was terrible like i'm not even gonna front last night was terrible the pain kicked in like I wanted to cross it, but I took my hair down last night. That's how much pain I was in. It was, I don't know, bro. it was hot. My teeth was hurting, my hair was hurting me because my edges, I don't got no edges. Because they postpartum took my shit out. I don't know. I still feel pain. I took, I even took some medicine last night. I said I was not gonna take my medicine because it was like, tolerable but baby last night was not like i just could not bear through the pain like i couldn't even sleep like i couldn't even fall to sleep like once i'm sleep my mouth go numb and i don't feel no pain so but but yeah like i woke up and about five minutes you start to feel the tingling sensation coming back and i'm just like damn i thought the shit was gone 
Like, I was regretting it last night. I was pissed. I woke Tavares up and told him he needs to get me by 8, 4 o'clock in the morning. I'm like, look, I can't do this. I can't do this shit tonight. And he got to leave. I got to take my hair down. I got in the tub and, and I put the water on boiling hot. Because I usually don't take a bath in scorching hot water because it made my skin real dry. But last night, I did not care. I needed something to soothe me and to calm me down because I didn't have nothing else to calm me down so I was like okay I just need to just get in a tub and just like I was trying my best to inhale and exhale slowly the way I could calm myself down but it was hard it was really hard I'm not even gonna attempt to try to chew anything today like they hurt bad I got some mashed potatoes and I got a, a lemonade and I'm hoping that the coldness yeah because last night oh my god when I got out the tub, I, I bought some ice cream. Thank God I bought ice cream. And I just ate the ice cream in my teeth. It made my gums feel so much better. But I was in agony. I was pissed. I had an attitude last night. I mean, this morning. Because it was 4 o'clock this morning. But yeah. Anyway. So that's my update for day three. Okay, y'all. So I just ate some Fusakalis. And I was able to choose a meat. I'm not going to lie. The back of my teeth hurt when I wear some teeth there. But, yeah, I was able to eat some, why did I say a food sack at least? I just got a box and I got chicken finger fries. I didn't want the cold sauce, so I just got an extra sauce and a toast. And it was so good. Oh, my God, it was so good. Like, ooh, it was so I can't wait until this week was up so I can go eat some, but I was actually able to eat it tonight. Cause my husband was going, I was like, well, since you going, I was gonna try to eat it too. Like, but I didn't, I couldn't bite the chicken tenders. I had to like break it into little bitty pieces and stuff. And then like the crunchy skin, I couldn't eat that. Only thing is, y'all, it took forever to floss. I had chicken all in my brackets. Chicken was all in my rackets. I feel like it's chicken stuck in between my teeth, or maybe it's just I don't know. It feel like you know, like that little weird, annoying feeling when some food is stuck in your teeth. It feel like that now, like in my back teeth. But when I was trying to floss, the the freaking floss would not go in between my teeth. It's like my teeth are there ain't no space for it to go through. And definitely, like, at the bottom, my friend took a teeth at the bottom, it was way more space between those teeth. And it already closed up. Like, it's just a little more space left. And I bet you they're going to be closed all the way by the end of the week. I know it. It's like, I can feel my teeth moving towards each other. But anyway, it's 11.50. So, I just wanted to just to come back and just let y'all know that I was able to eat some food sacklets and it was so good. See, what I usually do, I usually be eating all night, but I already know. Like, after this, what I just went through, my husband ain't got to worry about me in the kitchen late at night waking him up. A woman stuff up trying to eat. No, nah, I'm good. I ain't got time to be trying to floss. Brush my teeth every time I eat something. I ain't got time. But anyways, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Hey y'all, so it's day four. And when I tell y'all today has been a really, really, a really, really good day. Um, braces wise, like they don't hurt today. I feel pressure, you know, but as for the pain that I was feeling yesterday, which I don't understand why it just snuck up on me on day three. The the pain that I was feeling yesterday is gone. It's gone. But yeah, what did I eat today? I went. Oh my god, this truck. This van. I don't know if I can get in front of it. Mm, I think I'll be able to. Yep, bye bye. Y'all can see probably. I don't know if the person behind me is going to do the same thing. But, um. But yeah, I ate some Fuzakalis today. It was so good. Um, but that's the only, the only thing I ate today. 
but yeah, um, I still talk funny. I still talk funny. My teeth still look yellow as fuck, you know. But other than that, that's it. Um, on my way to Burlington, I gotta take some stuff back. And then I'll probably just go home. But I just feel like this is gonna be the end of day four vlog because it ain't really nothing to say other than they don't hurt anymore. It just feel weird. I'm just trying to get used to the braces because I'm just doing like that all the time. If I look sleepy, it's because I am. Yeah, I'm really sleepy right now. So yeah, that's it. Um, I'll see y'all.